Today I'm going to take a vintage Marshall and a vintage MXR phaser and try to replicate Eddie Van Halen's guitar tone. This is my 1974 Marshall. Uh, it's like a Plexi. It's a four input Marshall. I know Eddie used the 1969 Plexi, but we're going we're gonna to try this. This is the best I've got to offer. I've owned this amp for about a year now and never really did a proper test with it. This is the original, one of the original 4x12s that came with it. It's got the Celestian and Greenbacks. This thing sounds great. I'm going to run this Phase 90. This is a Phase 90 from sometime in the 70s. Funny story about this Phase 90 is it was owned by a country music star, Curly Chalker. Curly Chalker was a, a steel player. He was on Hee Haw and he made albums. He's in the Country Music Hall of Fame. But his son gave me this Phase 90 a couple years ago. So we're going to run this vintage Phase 90 in this Marshall and going to run it through this Bougera Power Soak. I don't really have the capability right now to run this amp on 10 so we're going to max this thing out we're going to run it pretty hot uh we may run it like on six or seven we'll, we'll crank it out to 10 we'll do different tests with the eq and settings so we're going to run the power soak so we can crank this marshall up without killing uh my ears and uh, what better guitar we're going to run the evh frankie with this with this demo so the frankie the vintage phase 90 and this 1974 Marshall. Okay, so here we go. We've got everything set at about 12 o'clock. I've got the master volume, or not the master, but volume one on two. We're in uh, input one, so volume one is what we are using. The phase 90 is not on, but this is what this sounds like. <laughs> It's not breaking up enough, I don't think. We're gonna bring this up to about 12. I've heard that these old Marshalls, everything on 12 is, 12 o'clock is the best. <laughs>
Of fun. I think that the Marshall sounded a lot like Van Halen in the early years. The Phase 90 certainly added a lot to that element, obviously. The Marshall, when it was cranked up to 10, had the best sound. The uh, Bougera Power Soak takes a little bit of the, the organic sound of the amp away. Uh, it would certainly sound better without the Bougera Power Soak, but all in all, I was really impressed. Hey, if you like the video, 
please uh, subscribe to my channel. It helps me out a lot, and I look forward to doing more of these for you in the future. Thank you.